Most cities of 33,000 people don't have a full service arena and convention center that hosted Elton John last year. Most cities of 33,000 people don't have a full service hotel and casino like we have. Most cities of 33,000 people don't have a 16,000 person waterfront concert venue right in the heart of Main Street. It's an incredible way to live this incredible small town New England city feel, but have access to the whole world. Bangor is a gateway to incredible wildlife. We have moose, black bears, white-tailed deer. We have a wide variety of colorful songbirds. We have a land trust that is devoted to conserving property, a river that has amazing rapids for rafting and canoeing and kayaking. Uh, we also have some more calm water like Pushaw Lake. Another unique amenity and natural wonder here in Bangor is the Kandeskeg Stream. We have sponsored and, and run the Kandeskeg Stream canoe race for 53 years now. Hundreds of paddlers and their associated fans descend on Kandeskeg Village and make their 16 and a half mile paddle down the Kandeskeg Stream to eventually finish in downtown Bangor. We embrace all four seasons in Bangor. We have in the spring, people are going out on bird walks and wildflower walks. In the summer, this place is just hopping with people who are here for events and concerts and conventions and downtown is just lit up. In the fall time, we have gorgeous fall foliage that everybody gets out and enjoys. And you can stay active in the winter as well, from snowshoeing, cross-country skiing, ice climbing. I've worked a lot of places, lived a lot of places, and the air and the water here is like nowhere else. The air here in Maine, you can feel it as soon as you step off the plane if you're visiting, as soon as you open your front door when you start your day. Acadia National Park and Bar Harbor are right over there. Mount Katahdin and the Appalachian Trail are right up the highway. And anywhere else in the world you want to go, Bangor International Airport is right over there. It really is the best of both worlds. It's like a big city experience, but with a quiet, close community. And we don't have a rush hour. We have a rush minute. She's absolutely right. It only takes me less than five minutes to get home. I've lived in San Francisco, lived in Boston, lived in Washington, D.C. Here in Bangor, I found the perfect fit. In Dallas, St. Louis, L.A., commute time could have really been anywhere from 45 minutes to who knows. Here in Bangor, I've got 10 minutes into the office, 10 minutes back at the end of the day. My rush hour is often comprised of, do I hit one red light or two red lights? You know, where I used to work before, it was 42 miles, an hour and a half on a good day. If there was a raindrop, that was two. If there were three raindrop, it was two and a half. And so I'm able to work longer days and still go to soccer games, softball games, or just go home and chill. Pretty sweet.